In South Africa, men are less likely than women to know their HIV status. They are also less likely to be on antiretroviral treatment, less likely to have an undetectable viral load, and less likely to survive AIDS-related illnesses. Evidence shows that men are anxious about receiving an HIV-positive result and worry about the stigma that the result can bring, as well as the impact that an HIV-positive diagnosis has on changing how they live their lives. This stops patients from coming forward for testing. Our study has tested a potential solution to overcome these barriers. Undetectable equals untransmittable or U equals U messaging. U equals U messaging explains that if you are HIV positive and are on antiretroviral therapy, your viral load can be so low that it is undetectable. This means you cannot transmit HIV to others through sex. Our study involved a series of human-centered design co-creation workshops in partnership with Matchboxology during which we asked men in the community who would typically walk by the Dudu tester how best to deliver the U equals U message. These conversations helped us to draft a script for men within the community to communicate the U equals U message to their peers. The phrase Kuselik Aslam or protecting my community was central to the message. The team also developed two different invitations to be distributed on different days. The result of our study was clear. Double the number of men who received the U equals U invitation came forward for testing. Despite being cut short by the COVID-19 lockdown in South Africa, the results of the study were robust thanks to the rigorous study design. This study shows how effective U equals U messaging can encourage men to come forward for HIV testing. There are four key components to implement a behavioral nudge intervention. Rapid testing, low cost, the use of pre-existing structures, and the implementation of a rigorous study design. Our study succeeded in these four areas. When implementing a nudge intervention, rapid implementation is key. This intervention took place in just three weeks. With the exception of the co-creation workshops to develop the U equals U messaging, the intervention also cost very little. To help minimize the duration and cost of the study, the researchers used a pre-existing Dutu tester structures. Our next steps will be looking to scale up our intervention to help larger numbers of patients across South Africa. Read more about the findings in the trial paper published in AIDS and Behavior and about the methodology in AIDS Patient Care and STDs.